He's there. You can use more of them. It's a system-wide feature in the UI. When you turn it on, Data Saver sends HTTP traffic from your device to your proxy, which compresses things like images and videos. Some of the most popular mobile browsers have been doing this type of compression for a few years. But MIUI Data Saver works for traffic from all apps on your device, not just the browser. It's powered by the company that invented browser compression, Opera Soft. Data Saver allows you to save up to 50% of your data, which means that you can look at Instagram photos for twice as long, read one and a half times more articles from you summer, or view three times as many lines. It even works for YouTube videos, saving an average of around 40%. You can monitor the savings from the summary, which shows how much data you use for each app. As you can see here, Instagram is pretty good, saves a little bit from Chrome. This feature is powered by Opera Max. The awesome team from Opera, I think, is over right there in the front. Thank you, guys. Uh, India e fans have been asking us to implement this since we added it to UI in China a year ago. Today, we're adding Data Saver to every one of our international markets. So that's Data Saver. It's a system-wide UI feature that saves your data and saves you money. Most of our e fans have prepaid data points, so this is especially awesome for them. So now, let's talk about messaging. This here is my inbox. I can see I have a message from my dad, a couple of messages from my friends. Uh, but there are a bunch of services, service messages here as well. About half of my inbox is taken up by messages from companies. Texts from my friends and family are pushed out of the home page from inbox. The service messages here are different. I have two up top from HDFC Bank. Uh, I think this third one is some ad for managing my finances. I don't really know what that last, the last one is. Um, and in MIUI 7, we made this a lot better. What is it? Lens card. Lens card. Oh, I think it's because someone else wears glasses. <laughs> we made this better in UI 7, and we call it Smart SMS. Uh, so we filter all these service messages into the notification tab. This makes your inbox just show the important messages. So this notification tab is up there. Um, and now you can see the home screen just shows, me just shows messages from actual contacts. So if you need to see, can you actually go to the next? There you go. Uh, if you need to see the service messages, it's just one click away in the notification tab. So that's smart SMS filter. Uh, when we looked a little closer at these service messages here, we realized that a lot of really useful messages were OTPs, or one-time passwords. I'm sure everyone here is aware of OTPs and the pain they cause. One of the first things I had issues with when I moved to India. Um, and it's particularly painful for mobile transactions. I'm sure you've all encountered this problem. You're trying to buy something on your phone. The SMS comes in. Uh, and if you happen to see it coming in, you need to memorize that digit really quickly. If you miss it, you have to go find the message in your inbox. We've made this process easier in MIUI 7. We call it Quick OTP. Let me show you how it works. So here I'm in the store. Uh, I'm paying cash and delivery here, which requires an SMS verification. I enter my phone number, wait for the verification code. So when the SMS comes in here, uh, you can see right up here, we have highlighted the OTP digits in blue. Uh, and we've changed this reply button to copy, which makes it a lot easier. Thank you guys so, so much. 